morning everyone and welcome Today we are going to be presenting our new project For our project we developed a system smart safety car And for project background we have 5 steps a uh, four step in the procedure. Firstly, driver need to start the engine. Second, uh, the car can be driven after the alcohol test is done, and a uh, driver is seated properly. Next, cannot be driven if uh, alcohol reading is high. And the lastly, uh, data can be transmitted to the car. The problem statement of this project: We are focusing on the issue of alcohol in the driving because. It continues to be a major concern to both public safety and road safety, such as legal regulation as designated, safety as a side effect, limitation of existing solution, and prevalence of alcohol impaired driving. Next, for the system design, first the driver enter the car and doing alcohol test on the alcohol sensor via red test. And then, secondly, the result will be displayed on the database. Thirdly, the result will be displayed on the SUV screen and the interface. If the alcohol level is below 10 parts MPL, the driver can start the engine and activate the delivery. If the alcohol level is below 5 MPL and then above 5 MPL and then below 5 parts MPL, the driver can start the engine and activate the delivery and ultrasonic sensor is needed to ensure the driver posture was ready to be in a good condition. If the driver posture out of the ultrasonic center threshold, the laser will be triggered. Lastly, if the alcohol level above 5.5 MDL, the engine will be locked and the LED will be red. Also, the laser will be triggered. So our objective in this project is to construct an unhappy project that ensures the safety of the driver when they are in an unconscious state. Next, to avoid the prevalence of extreme alcohol in the driving. Next, the significance of our project is the successful completion of this project will have a profound short term and long term impact on various stakeholders such as the vehicle owners, society, legal authorities, and public safety. So now, let's go to the video of demo prototype. This is the dimension of imagination. It is an area which we call the twilight zone. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. As you can see, this is the our prototype. We've been create a car. Uh, we have a few component involved, such as a buzzer. We have LCD. We have a uh, uh, gas sensor. We have LED component. We have relay module to control our DC motor, and we also have uh, ESP32. All right. Uh, for this system, we use two sensor, which is uh, the distance sensor to make, make sure that the uh, uh, driver sit properly and the gas sensor This is our smart safety car Alright, in this project we have three conditions As you can see the first condition showing that the AC level is below 5.0 and the LED will turn into green and you can see that the motor is working which means that the, the, the driver can start the engine so the, the second condition is we set the threshold to 5cm as for the driver position and if the threshold is above, the piezo will start, will trigger and if not, the piezo will not be triggered as you can see here. So next I will go to the third condition which is the highest. If the alcohol level detect above 5.5 mgl, the DC motor will start and the piezo will trigger. So I will using this, as you can see, the DC motor will stop and the LED change color to red and the piezo is triggered. Okay, next the data will be saved into the database and this is the record of the sensor data and then we inherit the data into the user interface which is you can select by the conscious status. Firstly, we have the normal, lightly drunk and extreme drunk. If we select the normal, and then we can see this record, alcohol record, sensor status and data created. It also same output on the extreme drunk. Extreme drunk. Okay, so, 
For the lightly drunk, it's the, a little bit different, which is there are extra two columns, which is distance record from seat and then body posture while driving status. So that's all from me. Thank you.